palpate the tendons of the infraspinatus muscle and teres minor muscle. We have our patient sitting in a chair in an upright position, and we have her distal arm resting on a table that's raised so that her shoulder is at 90 degrees of flexion. Also to make the tendons more prominent, we're gonna have our patient come into slight adduction horizontally, about 10 degrees, and then into, into slight external rotation, about 20 degrees. And that's gonna make those tendons more prominent under that posterior lateral acromion. Now to specifically locate each tendon, we wanna feel for the posterior lateral acromion, which I've located right here. One finger breath down from the posterior lateral acromion is gonna be the tendon of the infraspinatus muscle. And now to make that tendon more prominent, I'm gonna have my patient resist external rotation. Push them into my hand, and I feel a tendon becoming prominent under my index finger. Now for the, uh, for the peris minor muscle tendon, we're gonna go two finger width below the posterior lateral acromion. And again, I'm gonna ask my patient to do a submax isometric, push into my hand, and I feel a tendon popping two finger width down from that posterior lateral acromion.